Now, while today was Petri's first listening session in the area, Kagan's had several. But Petri so far, as you've just seen, have been less hectic. So what advice does Petri have for Kagan? Well, you know, we each have to do the best we can. So. Well, Representative Kagan held his third health care listening session this week earlier today, and he has another one scheduled for tonight. But this morning, there were fewer people in the crowd. Fox 11's Becky DeVries was there and has multiple views for us. After two days of packed listening sessions, oh, yes. Democratic Representative Steve Kagan talked with a quieter, smaller group at the Oconto Falls Senior Center Wednesday morning about changing America's health care system. And you shouldn't be discriminated against. Though this crowd was fewer in number than earlier this week, people here still had plenty to say to Kagan. He's promoting a plan that's not good for America. It's going to be uh, rationed health care for seniors and for infants, and it's not something that America reads, needs right now. It's a very cordial and very constructive conversation, and I got to tell you, I need their help to get the best ideas to put into that bill. The best ideas have to win the day. Not the special insider interests, but the people ought to have their voice, and that's exactly what I'm trying to do. I think the man's trying, and I, I think he does a, a good job. And uh, people seem to be very happy, some people anyway, and we're, they're not being asked to change their to change their insurance companies, I guess they're afraid of competition. From the government? Yeah. I don't think that by government sticking their hands into this is going to help anything. Others voice concerned about if there will be enough doctors to provide health care under the plan, changes the bill will see before it's finalized, and if there is enough money for the plan. Well, the question about can we afford it has to wait until we see the final bill. There's still things going in and out of this discussion about what will be included. We can't afford not to reform our health care system, and now it's a question of doing it in the best way possible. In Oconto Falls, Becky DeVries, Fox 11 News.